Well, I got one for you today. Today is a reveal of a 10-day fuel mileage challenge in a 2015 Mac CXU 613. We'll break down the numbers, how much it costs me just in fuel alone in these last 10 days. I'm going to put this out there too. This is with no fuel additives added to my truck for 10 days. I normally add fuel ox, the, the fuel catalyst, at every fill up. Well, I don't have any right now, so I didn't buy any. I didn't add anything to my tanks in this 10 day fuel challenge. Um, this fuel challenge consisted of 4,269 miles. Now we're gonna go over the actual retail cost and then the cost that I actually paid for the fuel because I think that's really important. If you're an owner operator, you need to find yourself a good fuel card. Um, there was three ways that I purchased fuel in these 10 days. There was mud flap, my, the carrier's com data card, and my own TBC Pro Driver card, which I highly recommend. Go check them out. Their fuel prices are in certain parts of the country as competitive as the my carrier the carrier i'm leased on to's com data card so yeah that's the numbers we're going to get into on this 10-day fuel challenge in this 2015 mac all right before i jump into the numbers i would like everybody real quick to hit the thumbs up on this video let's try and get 65 thumbs up on this video and if you haven't already hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell so you're notified every time I drop another video. All right, the suspense is killing me too, so I'll share the miles per gallon right away and hit a home run, but make sure you stay around for the rest of the video because I broke down retail costs versus what I paid for the fuel, and I think it's pretty interesting. So, And I put post-it notes up here, so if you see me looking over here, that's what I'm looking at. Well, let's reveal what this Mac 2015 CXU got. Um, so in 10 days, I traveled 4,269 miles. I pumped 595 gallons of fuel. That means this truck's miles per gallon was 7.17 miles per gallon. Um, not terrible actually and that like i said is with absolutely no fuel additives so now i'm going to break down some other very interesting retail numbers versus what i paid so make sure you stay tuned all right let's get into the retail costs that is if you had absolutely no fuel discounts what you would be paying at the pump versus fuel discounts. Um, once again, there was three ways that I purchased fuel on these. I ended up filling the truck up. I don't think I've mentioned this six times to get to that 595 gallons. Um, sometimes I was pumping 60 gallons, sometimes 40 gallons, depending on where I was, because I wanted to get the best price on fuel that I could. So I would pump just enough fuel to get me to like Pennsylvania where the IFTA tax was really high and I had some big fuel savings or to Illinois where I had great fuel savings plus a high IFTA. But yeah, I ended up purchasing fuel through Mudflap one time. I used the company's Com Data card twice. The other three fuel ups were done on my personal TBC Pro Driver card. So the retail average that I was paying for fuel if I didn't have any discounts would have been $4.39. Man, that's a lot of money. But my savings discount, the average that I paid for fuel on these six fuel ups was $3.59. All right. Let's get into the actual fuel ups. Uh, Stop One's pump price was $4.51. I had a savings of $1.04 four per gallon at that fuel stop. That means I paid $3.55 at the first fuel up. I ended up pumping 142 gallons there for a savings of $143.04. The second stop, the pump price was $4.29. I paid $3.54. That is a savings of 75 cents per gallon. I pumped 114 gallons there for a fuel savings of $85.50. Stop three, the pump price was $3.89. I paid $3.17. 
That is a fuel savings of 72 cents. I only pumped 60 gallons there and saved $43.20. Um, stop number four had a pump price of $4.19. I paid $3.39. That is a savings of 80 cents per gallon. I pumped 144 gallons there for a savings of $115.20. Stop five, the pump price was $4.38. I paid $3.96. That is a savings of 42 cents. That was the mud flap stop. Um, I pumped 60 gallons of fuel for a savings of $25.20. The sixth and final stop had a pump price of $4.92. I paid $3.81. That is a fuel savings of $1.11 per gallon. I pumped 75 gallons there for a savings of $83.21. Sorry, $83.25. Now let's talk about the retail cost. Um, had I not had those fuel savings, I would have spent $2,609.40 on the 595 gallons that I pumped. That is a cost per mile in fuel of 61 cents. But that's not what I paid. I ended up saving $494.89 on my six fuel ups. So I ended up paying $2,114.51 for my fuel. That is a cost per mile in my Mac for fuel of 49 cents. That's what I believe in. I believe fuel economy is gonna sustain the market that we're in right now. I am trying to do everything I can to get better fuel economy in the trucks that I own. Um, I already know the Mac isn't the best in fuel economy, but I've added some things to this truck in prior months. I added air tabs, I added wheel covers, and I've seen a difference. Once again, I got 7.17 miles per gallon in 4,269 miles in this 2015 Mac, and I ran the speed limit. Um, I didn't drive 57 or 62 miles an hour. I ran 65 to 66 miles per hour for the total 4,269 miles. Obviously, if I was making a delivery, I wasn't running that, um, but I didn't idle the truck at all. This truck is equipped with an APU, so I ran that. Um, my idle time was very low. I drove out to from Minnesota out to the East Coast, back to Minnesota, and then ran around the Midwest to get those 4,269 miles in 10 days. So I was in some tough terrain for this truck out, out, out East. Um, but for the most part, I'm pretty happy with what I paid for the fuel once again. I got 7.17 miles per gallon. The retail cost would have cost me $2,609.40, but that's not what I paid. I actually paid $2,114.51 for a cost per mile in fuel of 49 cents for 10 days and a savings of $494.89. So. Yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, you've made it this far in the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, you know what it is. Keep on trucking.